A tragic turn to the holiday weekend. A 74-year-old woman is dead, and police blame celebratory gunfire. Investigators tell us the victim was hit by a stray bullet in Durham. Mackenzie Stasco is covering this story live, and Mackenzie, neighbors are alarmed, and they also want some answers tonight. Maggie, they sure do. This all happened yesterday in Durham as a group of neighbors were gathering, celebrating the 4th of July holiday when Durham police say one of them was hit by what they call celebratory gunfire. Neighbors say they want justice for this senseless act. Durham police say 74-year-old Paulette Thorpe was celebrating the 4th of July with neighbors at this brick house on Burlington Avenue. We was talking. We was talking. I was talking to her. We was all conversating. When all of a sudden, around 11 o'clock, they heard a loud boom. At first, neighbors tell me they couldn't tell if it was fireworks or gunshots. Didn't know which way it come from. We saw Paulette hit a chest like this. So, oh, something bit me. Something came out and hit her kind of in the chest. And we thought it was a bug or something. Durham police say Thorpe was hit by a stray bullet. They say someone fired a gun into the air to celebrate the holiday. But when the paramedics got here, they, they seen what the deal was and they took her straight to do. They knew they had to move fast. Police say Thorpe died a short time later. She was always a well, well dressed woman. All the time you see her, she was already always made up and everything. And she's a very sweet person, very friendly, and I'm gonna miss her. I really am. They don't know who fired the gun or from where, but neighbors suspect it came from a nearby park. As they cope with the loss of their friend, they hope the person who took her life will turn themselves in. It, it's senseless. You don't be shooting up in the air. I don't know what you, because you know, bullets don't have no names on them. I don't know what's gonna happen, but she's gonna be very missed, though. Now, Durham police are investigating this case as a homicide, but have not released any additional information on possible suspects. But if you have any information on this shooting, you're asked to give Durham Crime Stoppers a call. Live in Durham, Mackenzie Stasco, CBS 17 News.